only on Sunrise every Tuesday morning in the 6 o'clock half hour. We're putting a spotlight on local businesses around our area. So here's another edition of Sunrise Stops and Shops. I'm Molly Smith and you're watching Stops and Shops. This week I'm giving you an exclusive look into a brand new business that just opened in Grants Pass. So parents, listen up while I talk to the owner of Little Beans Playroom. So Lee, can you tell me a little bit about the inspiration for this concept? Yeah, um, I think after having my first daughter um, and then falling pregnant with my second one really quickly, I realized that I needed, and a lot of other people around here, needed a space where we could bring our children. And I went back to London after five years with a child now, so I was seeing it in a completely different way. Um, and I noticed that play cafes were a thing in London. For anyone who doesn't know, what is a play cafe? A play cafe is a space where children can come while under the supervision of their parents or caregivers. Um, and we cover things from gross motor play um, to imaginative play, STEM building activities, quiet corners, and we have a baby corner as well. Um, we also offer classes. We um, open our space out for events. And we are hoping to open our cafe um, between March and June this year. And some of our core values are creating healthy snacks for children and their parents. A lot of children's play areas traditionally just accommodate to the children. Why do you think it's important for parents to also be considered in the planning? Um, I think when, when we were growing up, we didn't really think of it because we had these huge kind of indoor play zones that were brightly colored, kids are running everywhere. And um, as a mum now going into those play zones, I come out and I'm exhausted. It's a little overwhelming and overstimulating. Um, and I think it's really important to create a space where parents can come with their children, where they can somewhat feel relaxed in that environment too. 